Hello ladies and gentlemen, how are you doing? My name is Jeffrey Blyde and welcome to Raging Falcon Pro Wrestling Z Fed. You're watching Boom episode 81 live from Frankfurt in Germany. We're kicking off tonight with a one on one match in the Glamazon division. And first. Sure to follow us on twitch.tv slash rfpw network where we uh, strive to come to you with the live shows as soon as possible again uh, reckoning that we'll be starting on uh, Monday the 16th of July with Fight Night's newest episode the flagship show of RFPW ever since 2014 Her opponent tonight comes from Turin, Italy She's the dancing diva of wrestling, Mercedes Richie. It's good to know that Mercedes is doing so well. And currently the number three contender. So I want to make sure to get that up into the rankings. Of course, the ongoing clashes between uh, Santana Garrett and Taylor Hendricks. But once that is over, Mercedes Richie has vowed to make it all hers. Where's the boostage? Currently the number 11 contender at the bottom of the list. And it's on the opening match here tonight. Tonight, the main event, triple threat match. We'll find out later who is that going to be. Going to be Josh Sniper versus Daniel Chapman. And, and of course, we're not ready. But we should keep an eye out for all of it that's coming along. And of course, the former European champion Tyler Bates. So Josh Sniper, Daniel Chapman, and Tyler Bates in a triple threat match. Furthermore, the Lion Kid against Zack Sabre Jr. Taylor Essex, the current European champion against Shane Hunter and tonight a match between Santana Garrett and Taylor Hendricks after weeks of smack talking. Takedown of the legs by Wesna Vucic. Rollover. And what's going to happen at our next pay-per-view the summer games we've kept it in the shadows for a long time but on uh, we have an official day today ladies and gentlemen uh, an official date I should say the Sunday the 5th of August 2018 the third annual summer games will be coming to your screens uh, in premiere live on Twitter TV slash rfpw network so make sure to follow us and if you haven't done so far check out the summer games of 2016 and 17 2016 are very uh, well our largest pay-per-view to date so it's going only going to get better And here goes Mercedes Richie take down face first for Western Busic. Grab the head and that didn't look good. Cover only one kind. And now, 
Mercedes Rachel with a lovely, lovely moonsault. And when will Mercedes Richie strike for the final time? Oh, wait a minute. Keeps hanging on, on the apron. No, oh, fights back. Good for her. And that's it. Where's Nabusic in trouble? There comes the devolution. Good night, Wesner. And here comes the cover. That's it, Mercedes Richie wins. Great victory by Richie from Italy. Solid victory, quick, fast, high pace, impactful. That's what you want to have in your matches. Of course, you want to have what, half an hour uh, legendary matches, but these are the ones that count as much as anyone else. And she just did it quickly with the devolution. So she can have a dance off. Yes. Oh, wait a minute. Here's little Miss Roxy. Where is she coming from? All of a sudden, that's clothesline. A party's over now. Don't know why little Miss Roxy wants in. She's the number nine contender. Of course, I reckon why she would do it. Got to take it easy. Oh, on the shoulder blades. But I don't get to why. Oh, Mercedes Richie was waiting. Had so much energy left. This had been a longer match. I doubt. Uh, I think Lemons Rock would have a better chance. But there's the spear by Richie. Lemons Roxy now in the same jeopardy, same corner as Wilson Abusic. Lemons Roxy gets devolutionized. Crowd sees it goes wild, see the attack has been stopped. Ah, oh, Richie says, oh, what the hell, get out of my ring. Good for her. Lovely bit of France music. While we wait for Lion Kid against Zack Sabre Jr. Welcome back in Frankfurt of Mine, Germany. On this very, very special boom, aired on Sunday, 15th July. And for the match, the men's division match, get up for one fall. And introducing first, he comes from England, he's the Lion Pip. Don't know why you could call him a Lion Kid anymore, more than a Lion Adult, but hey, still, Lion Kid's here. Ready to impress. No championships. Had four championship opportunities. Three times for the cruiserweight title. One time for the tag team title, but didn't manage to get any single one of them into conversion. Similar to break points. Today on this Sunday, the 15th of July, many great things happening in the world of sports. World Cup final of football. Tour de France in the Paris Robert Mini Tour. Men's final in Wimbledon, Formula E, DTM, this morning Formula 3 even. It's been an amazing roller coaster here today with many other sports being competed here throughout the summer. And so is pro wrestling here. He doesn't need no team music nor does he need an introduction but here he is as the team suplex member from the Isle of Sheppey, England, Zach. Saber Junior. It's always good to see him because you know he always delivers in his matches. No need to deny it because that's just what it is.
And now we are waiting for this match to get started. It's going to be an absolute slobber knocker of technical wrestling. So let's see what they can bring to the table. And we have just started. Here we go. Oh man. Ouch. There we go, take down with the nice neck breaker, swing neck breaker, line kid goes for a splash. Okay. Did not expect that, but hey. It's an option, you know. Man. Lion Care goes for the rules route. It's going to be high flying but technical as well. Man. Surprised to see it's all going this well. Oh, so close! But that is what you can expect, of course. And it should be happening, you know? Flying Kid now taken down with a German suplex, and that's what we're known for from him, of course. Take down. Oh no, wait a minute. Zach Sibber Jr. is stalking on his prey. And another German suplex. When will it end? Questions that needed to be asked and answered. The Lion Kid never gives up. Even though his chances are so very slim. Only a one count this time round. But you gotta wonder will it be coming anything more than that? Or is that it? Like I said, Virginia only just retu recently returned last week. Oh, no, there it is, but he's in the ropes. He's in the ropes and has to let go. That's why we know. Only a one count. I mean, can be reasonably happy with it. This match is going to high heights in order to get to uh, to victory. And these people want to rise up to contenders as fast as they can because it's not all looking good. But now it looks like Lion Kid's final seconds of strike in this match. 
There we go, there's your on break car. Will Lank it off the top. Dizzy, Zack Sabre Jr.'s expertise, and he does. Zack Sabre Jr. wins the match. What a great evening. I cannot believe it. Should be definitely happy with this. I mean, the submission strength that and the technical skill that Zack Sabre Jr. has is described in just one word. Mastery. Absolute master of this ring, provides in all corners give and take, and it's without a doubt that I see Zack Shaver Jr. rise among the ranks fast enough to be in the title scene for the European Championship. Zack Shaver Jr. of course has a hat pedigree in RFW. I'm not too sure whether that was the European title. I think he might have. Maybe not, we'll have to check that out. We'll look up the facts for you. And I reckon he might have, but I'm not too sure. I was already part of uh, RFW during the early days. And next up, Shane Hunter takes on the European Champion, Taylor Essex. Alright. Uh, the Aerial Wizards, of course, um, had a championship. The tag team titles, Will Ospreay and Zack Sabre Jr. But that didn't last long enough before they parted ways in a contract dispute after Season 7A. And here is the dancing Don of our FW, it's Shane Hunter. Dancing Deep it was victorious, but Disco Shane is ready for the take and he's hunting the European champion. Question is whether it's enough to take it, but ooh, I don't know. But now let's get ready for his opponent. And here he is, ladies and gentlemen. He comes from Essex, England. He's the king of selfies. And he's also the reigning European champion for Raging Falcon Pro Wrestling. It is Taylor Essex. He's not only that, of course, also Taylor Essex since the 17th of September 2017, the RFPW Live champion. When he won the uh, championship against Josh Faulkner and Yeston Rees in Trowbridge, England. So all eyes, all ears, all nerves pointing the same way to the current European champion. Try to make it in the academy, that didn't work out as planned. But the RFW Live champion knows he's distant more. Looking, haven't seen our FW Live in Trowbridge in England last year. Make sure to check out youtube.com and search for our FW Live. 
you'll find all bits and pieces on the network. We're on the way, Shane Hunter against Taylor Essex. What a take that. Oh my god, what a start. Great start for him here today. straight from the get go it's going to be tough to counter and combat that but I know that they're sure as hell will try knee strike now puts him in the ropes oh try to super kick him that didn't work oh what the hell what a handstand out of nowhere. It's gonna take him down. Sweet pain. And it, uh, inducted on the face of Taylor Essex at the European uppercut now. Keeps it going with the quick punch combinations. And I reckon that is the best cause of action. But here comes Taylor Essex back into the ring. Doesn't want to waste any time. Essex and Hunter. Goes to the Oregon run after all. None have expected that now. The arm. Very, very painful. Sit down. Oh, wait a minute. That was countered. Smart move by Essex here. Now the elbow strikes to the top of the head. Oh, Shane Hunter. Oh my God, nice hurricane runner there. And now a standing moonsault. To the top rope he goes. Inside 450 splash. Great mark, Taylor Essex. Cover. And that's got to be the end of Shane Hunter. Three. <laughs> and let's take a look shortly at the replay. We can see Taylor Essex taking down Shane Hunter right here. The standing moonsault. And the inside. 450 splash. The trademark finisher by the European champion remains on today as the referee steps on Shane Hunter. He's adding more uh, injury to injury and insult. Taylor Essex wins. We are now to the Glamazon division. Taylor Hendricks, number one contender against Santana Garrett. Current Glamazon's champion has recovered from injury. And uh, so let, let's hope to see what things will be going around for. So that's why you got to wait right now. Oh, wait a minute, we're already started. Bang on. Garrett wasting no time after what happened. When Taylor Hendricks and Santana Garrett earlier struck face to face, Garrett taken out on the stretcher. Taylor Hendricks throwing her off, attacking her. The match in the way, and Taylor Hendricks going flying around the ring. Santana Garrett and beautiful pieces of action cover made by Garrett. One. Jesus, what a great start. We're always awaiting this. We're happy to see that this is happening as well. Take down. 
Beautiful display here. Splash! Ropes going around. Kick! Roundhouse kick. Gerard again in trouble. And this champion will have to defend her glams and title, likely against Tilda Hendricks. When? Not sure yet. But it's going to be an amazing strategy. We're out here. Bye. Oh, Tina, when the elbow drop, yes. Keeping it on the edge now. Oh no, 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 no. Wait a minute. Just waiting for it. Taylor Hendricks now. So, yeah, drop Santana Garrett. Really far down. And this is not looking good. Here it is, the Tombstone Pile Driver. Will this be the tombstone for the Glamazons champion here tonight? And it is Taylor Hendricks, the former women's champion, 100 days reigning. Got relieved of her championship when the new season was introduced. Yeah, well, she is your winner. What a thing to say. Taylor Hendricks again, your winner of here tonight. Absolutely amazing. And now we come to the final match of the evening. Your main event. It's the winner of this match. And we'll have a great shot at going upwards and onwards.
So let's see what I can do here. Could be making for a great opportunity. And one of his opponents here tonight comes from. Commentary. Man, oh man. The final opponent is the former European champion. He doesn't like when I say it, but that's the way it is, and that's the way you're gonna uh -huh, uh -huh, uh, like it. Ladies and gentlemen, he is Tyler Bay. Also, former, excuse me, tag team champion. It's going to be great, that's for sure. Ding, ding, ding. We're on the way. And Josh Sniper is the first one to receive a suplex. And then it's Daniel Chapman always tired about trying to prove he's better than what anyone does. Tyler Bate, uh, I think, has the highest opportunities to win here tonight. But I'm not running at Daniel Chapman either. He's had a great state of victory, surprising victories as well. And then the arm breaker, Tyler Bate, break, Tyler Bate breaks it up. Tongue twister right there. If you're watching the show in the morning, which is sure because it's the only option here tonight, but for the rest of the show since 2014. Make sure to subscribe at youtube.com slash rfpw2014. Like, comment as well. And make sure to follow us on twitch.tv slash rfpw network. For social media, Facebook and Twitter are available to you. Also at rfpw efed. Take down by Josh Sniper with a spine buster. Keeps it going. This is the drop kick. Now for Tyler Bates, still in contention. The European uppercut. Another suplex air at no the suplex is boom episode 81. Now off the top rope offense as well. From the United Kingdom champion Tyler Bate in a great and grand promotion. Debatable to see whether it's the biggest of the world. And again, oh, take down. Try to go for the cover. 
but the arms were under the ropes and now um, forces a world break. No valid pinfall or submission attempts can be made. Oh, on the knees now. Sniper has the world and the ring to his own right now. But Chapman gives one back. Knee strike to the gut. And there we go, a huge power slam by Daniel Chapman. One, two, one pound. Daniel Chapman can win it here. One, two. The referee didn't have to go around. I think it might have been an opportunity here. One. Two. Take down with it, choke slam for a rock bottom cover. No road break again. One. Two. This match is going all places, all around. Unbelievable. Unbelievable that we're back again with this. Man. Can we just try to get a winner here? Now it's a game between Daniel Chapman and Tyler Bates. Since we don't have a clear number one contender, this might be the one. But it's still a couple of weeks left till we get to the Summer Games. The 5th of August on a Sunday, 2018. The biggest party of the year. Two. Oh, and a roll around Tyler Bate. Oh, two and gets out. Goodness me. Oh my 
God. Decapitation. If you look at and ask him yourself. My God. Pile of eight. Looks out of it. Gets towards Rose. George Schneider looking to steal it too. I need my Steve because I to use what matters here in our going to be our very first slogan and I crave the sugar right now because this is energy consuming this match spine buster sniper turns it around the arm drag quick hands all around you can see these guys are exhausted Now the stretch of the neck. It's not done yet. Tyler Beck gets out. And sweeps Sniper off his feet. DDT! And goes for a suplex now. No, Daniel Chapman blocks. And does a suplex of his own. Crowd is really hyped for this match. And so should they be. Sniper is going to try and take him out. That didn't work. Tyler Bay also misses. What's going on? We called it. A botch! An odd other than a double botch! Alright! Bang! Spine Buster! Sniper and looks to have the best opportunity now. Bottom stop. The bottom's down. Ooh, two counts. Take down with a neck breaker. Yes, sniper. How long can you make this last? It's not going to be easy, that's for sure. Job Buster. Points first to the canvas. Tyler Bate. Bottoms down. Sniper again. No. What a classic. Here at Boom episode 81. And Bay moves out of the way, comes back, punch landing, punch landing. Super, oh no, just let some drop, but it was going for a suplex there. Chapman now, surprise, no. Carla Bay on the counter. Chapman gets suplex. No, counter. We see Sniper getting back up. TKO. Tyler Bates. On the apron. No. Hooks the legs. Cover Chapman. One, two, three.
Alright, this has been Boom Episode 81. We'll be back soon with Fortnite on Monday night. Live on Twitch TV slash RR for the Network. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you next time. Daniel Chapman wins. Good night.